We are here, we're now looking into November the 1st and November the 2nd is 2023. And of course, everything that you will need to know about me is right down below in the description box. I do thank you so much for all of your love and your support and your donations, all right? Right now, I have a special personal read. It's $45 and we'll talk for 15 minutes on the phone. And you guys definitely need to go ahead and take advantage of this special because at the beginning of the year, the uh, prices will go up for my personal reading. So if you'd like a reading with me, I'm going to put my text line down below. If you want to ask a quick question about your situation, that's also going to be right down below to reach me. Okay. So anyway, let's see. We have one down here and this message for all the signs. Okay. Once again, November the 1st. Wow. Happy New month november the first and november the second happy birthday to the son of scorpio i raise you hope you enjoy your birthday what kind of message let's see do we have right here now holy spirit holy angels the page of cups the holy grail look at her holding it the holy grail it's like emphasis on this cup now what does cups represent cups represent a love offer maybe a love gesture could be the case you know, it's kind of innocent with the page, right? It's not like we're in a committed relationship or anything like that. But it's like a love gesture in some way. Okay, so I feel like somebody here could be saying some type of love gesture. And a love gesture, it doesn't have to be romantic in sense, right? But it could be for some people and others right here. You know, it's just a love gesture coming in some way. What's the message right here, please? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, message for the collector. Also could be... A younger water sign I'm getting right here for some people right here. Maybe this is a newborn child could be the case. If you just now had a baby, congratulations to you for some people here. I feel like you just now had a baby for some people here. Yeah, yeah. Seven of Wands right here. Okay, so I feel like that with the Seven of Wands right here that you're protecting this baby. Now, this baby right here could be an actual newborn baby, okay? And then others, something here that you're creating. Whatever you're creating right now, I feel like it's very new. I feel like you want to... You know, defend it right here in some way and protect it in some way here. Okay, what's the message here? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. The message right here is for the collective, please. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Okay, so we have right here Six of Pentacles right here. Yeah, this could be a new um, business venture. Or maybe it's a new job could be the case here. Okay. Now, if this is a newborn baby, there's a water sign because the Page of Cups could be a younger water sign baby, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. We're in Scorpio season, so this could even be a birthday party for um, a Scorpio baby. Six of Pentacles right here is about putting in, um, you know, the giving and receiving money right here in some type of way. <clears throat> right. What's the message right here, please? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. The moon card flips down here. Pisces or Cancer. I definitely have a water sign here. It's significant. Now, the moon card can represent fears or illusions right here. So, type, so type of way. Okay. Or at night. Okay, let, me see, let me see what else I got here. Okay. Yeah, because we just had a full moon, too. Yeah, we had a full moon right here. That full moon right there standing out. We just had a full moon. Okay. So that full moon was in Aries, okay? And Aries represent Mars and war or something like that. Okay, let me see here. Six of Pentacles right here. Okay, somebody's defeated right here, I feel. Five of Swords right here. It's a card of deception and defeat. Somebody could be heartbroken about something right here, I feel. Okay. Now, if somebody here is sending you a love gesture and you're declining it, they're heartbroken. I feel for some people here, okay? Yeah, the Queen of Swords right here. It could be Aquarius, a Libra, or Gemini. Yeah, so I'm feeling like right here that maybe that you're declining a love offer. Somebody here is heartbroken, I'm getting into pieces. I'm getting right here. You see how this, this right here, the heart right there? And then we have like 12 hearts all around here. We figured out the, the other day when I did the other video, it was called Broken Into Pieces, right? They're heartbroken into pieces. So I feel like they're heartbroken right here. They're still heartbroken, I'm getting right here. It's still helpful. Could be a quiet sleeper Gemini. Or anybody else could be okay, but yeah. I'm hearing like nobody does it like Sarah Lee. <laughs> oh my god. I feel like that you uh you're you uh do baking, okay, or you cook really good or something like that for some people right here. The how far right here. This could be a tourist or a marriage right here. Alright, let me put this down here. 
Okay, yeah, so this could be a tourist right here or a merch. I'm getting, okay, put this out. Okay. They're heartbroken right here, okay? They either, you know, they want to apologize to you or they want it right here, um, you know, for you to accept some love offer, something like that, you know? So that's heartbroken right there. I'm getting my hand. Now, you know, I don't know if it's a child. I don't know if a child has to do with something like this, okay? The child could be heartbroken then if somebody here is, you know, avoiding them or something like that. I'm getting like the child is heartbroken for some people here. Knight of Wands right here. Hmm. Summer illusion is over, I feel. Yeah, we're in Scorpio season death, okay? The moon. Summer, summer illusion is over. It ended, I feel. You know? It ended, I feel. Somebody's heartbroken now. Some illusion in some type of way could be over in some way. I don't know if they would want to have a child by you or this is a child that's heartbroken or something like that, okay? Or it could just simply even be that they're sending you love gestures and you're ignoring them. They're heartbroken about it, some people here. Okay, what's the last right here, please? The nine of wands right here and the ten of pentacles because they still was holding on to this or they were still wanting this or you or family or something like that. Somebody was. Okay. And they feel like this is a big old challenge right here or you're being defensive or something like that. Okay. Okay. Let me see what else here. So I'm here with like Macy. Somebody named is Macy or Mancy or something like that. Could be. And the star card right here. Could be Aquarius right here. So I feel like somebody has so much hope right here about a religion or about money or about you or Aquarius or something like that. A Taurus. Okay. Here's another way this could be right here. Somebody sending you a love gesture over here. You already in a relationship. Hmm. Could be the case. <sighs> That's one way of looking at it. Okay. Because I feel like over here, right? Somebody sending you a love gesture right here. Okay. I feel like with a ten of, of pentacles, it's gonna be somebody at work, or it could be right here, like um, you're in a relationship. Could be the case. A committed relationship right here. Okay. Somebody's heartbroken right here because you're in a relationship or something. All right. I feel like they really want to be with you or something. It could be the case. It could definitely be a Aquarius right here, a Taurus, a Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, or a Pisces, a Cancer, Scorpio, right like that. Yeah, four of cups right here. Because I'm here with somebody like, I was really, really liking you or digging you. I was really digging you. I was really liking you here. Okay, look at that. Yeah, you're somebody wish fulfillment, I feel. You know, and I got a wish card right here too. So it's like you double wishes or something like that. So I feel like you're somebody wish for feeling right here. Okay. Yeah, and seven of cups right here. Okay. That's what I feel. I feel like for some of you, this is what I kind of feel. I feel like somebody's stuck in between two lovers, I feel. Maybe there's one you're already in a committed relationship with and that's somebody else new here, right? Or something like that, but yeah. Somebody could be like, dang, you know. I feel like they're trying to back up because they know you got a relationship or something like that right here. Yeah, the five of pentacles right here. Okay. Somebody feel left out in the cold. All right. I'm getting like this Aquarius right here. Could be backing up for some people here. All right. Hmm. Because I feel like the, the Aquarius is detaching here, you know, because they know it's another relationship or something like that right here. This one right here is Aquarius and this one is Aquarius. Now, this Queen of Swords here is also Libra and Gemini, so it definitely could be an air sign or anybody else. Yeah, I got emphasis now over here on um, Gemini, so it could be a Gemini. 
Okay, two of wands right here. Let's see. For the spirit, holy angels. Okay, let's see what I got here. Four of wands are very small. Uh, tower. This could be a big revelation right here. Who you want to be with? Cause you know, cause some of you right here, maybe you're in a relationship, but there's somebody else over here. You know, of course, somebody gonna get left behind. Yeah, but I feel like for also somebody gonna be chosen here too. You know, somebody gonna be chosen too. I feel. Cause some of you, I feel like it's a third party here, a secret lover or something like that. You know, that's a secret lover here. Hmm. This one right here is intimacy, right? And then right here, the Knight of Wands is love sting or having a one night stand in secret with the moon card. So I feel like somebody having a secret lover right here. I feel right. Could be a Gemini or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or anybody else. Okay, but yeah. Hmm. If somebody thought they can influence you right here and they have secret lover, that's not going to work, okay? And the others, I feel like um, that somebody got a secret lover over here, but they're already in a relationship, right? And I feel like the relationship is with fulfillment. Some relationship here is with fulfillment. The tower is a revelation right here, okay? Understanding, okay? The hanging man. Okay, the hanging man is pausing and reviewing. The Queen of Cups right here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. <clears throat> I feel like they thought they could have two lovers or something like that. It's not going to go anywhere, I'm getting right here. Page of Swords. It's not going to go anywhere, I feel. Somebody's consciously aware they have another lover for some people here. Maybe somebody straight told them. Maybe somebody said, yeah, I'm in a relationship. So somebody's consciously aware about it for some people here. But they was thinking they could have two lovers. I'm not sure somebody here had a one. They stand with them and they just backed up. I don't know. I feel like the Aquarius or something like that. See, I feel like somebody can't handle the fact that the Aquarius is detaching like that or something like that. I don't know. Hmm. Because I feel like the Christ knows that this is, you know. <laughs> and anyway, let me see. Let me see what's going on here. All right. Six of swords right here and the ace of one. So, ace of wands right here and the six of swords right here. The ten of swords right here and the devil card. Whew. So, I feel like somebody's stuck right here because they was intimate with somebody and they wanted to have two different lovers or something like that. Um, you know, and I just feel like that's really throwing somebody through a loop right here. How that Aquarius is going back up like that or detach. It's really throwing them off or something like that. I feel like they were thinking because you was intimate with them or something like that, that, you know, this would stay going on or something like that. But I feel like, you know, the Aquarius is an air sign. The Aquarius leave a Gemini. You know, the Queen of Swords is somebody... That's very analytical. They know what it is. You know, if this is only one night stand or something like that, then they're going to detach, I feel. They're not going to put their feelings deep into it, I feel, right here. Okay, so I feel like somebody feels left out, though. You know, they was like, Dad, I want you to be feeling this or wanting this or something like that, you know. Um, so I kind of feel. Any other message right here, please? Let me see if there's anything else they're going to give me right here, okay? Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune right here. Something here is fate. Something here is destined. It's a turning point right now in somebody's life. Maybe somebody needs to choose or something like that. It could be the case. The trade card right here. It could be a cancer or which way somebody's moving forward. So I feel like it's destined for somebody to figure out which way they're going forward right here. In some way. Right? Either it could be it's destined right here. that somebody here. They're going to be stuck if they're still lusting about somebody here as somebody saying no. That could be the case, too, for some people here. But I feel more so that somebody's detaching here, and that's kind of affecting them. That you're detaching right now. Okay. When they think about it, it's heartbreaking, you know. I feel like it's unexpected. Somebody could have thought right here because, you know, what I was going on right here, right? The full Air, um, Aries energy. They could have thought you was going to be all into this right here. And maybe you are. Some of you, you are all into this. But you have another lover. Hmm? If it's them, they have another lover. 
Sip of somebody do. Okay, five of cups right here, four of swords right here. Somebody's a regret here, I feel. This really does break their heart, I feel right there. Yeah, it's gonna break their heart right now because, you know, they was definitely wanting you to be into it. Okay, or maybe they was definitely wanting you to accept the fact they had another lover. You know, because sometimes people say, okay, I have I have a girlfriend, a boyfriend, or I'm in a relationship or whatever. And then somebody already know what it is, I feel, you know. So I feel like they was thinking that you would want a relationship, though, too. Will be a second relationship for some people here. Okay, and I just feel like that's really, really throwing them off to this Aquarius energy here. Yeah, they, they know how to detach, and that's what they're doing. I feel like that's affecting them right now. Okay, so anyway, that's what I have right here. Thank you so much for taking a look now. I'll send you all... Peace, blessings, love, and light. Namaste to you.